Hi guys this is SiggyQG35 Security today I will show you how to convert disk MBR to GPT and install Grub2Win on Windows 10. Explain. Set default Grub2Win on Windows 10 EFI boot. You need to convert MBR disk to GPT disk. So you can use only with UFI GPT mode. With AIO boot Grub2 and EasyBCD UEFI and adding new. Source system on Grub2Win list. Install Grub2Win on BCD UEFI Windows 10 EFI including Adding AIOBO OT Disk X.32.64.bit on Grub2Win list And install manually memtis.x64 on UEFI First download partition underscore wizard.x.86.64 Second download programs mbr.efi Third download Grub2Win Fourth download memtis86.64 Extract partition underscore wizard dot x point eighty six point sixty four dot zip. Go to file partition underscore wizard dot x point eighty six point sixty four. Go to partition wizard dot x point sixty four. Scroll down. Run as administrator. Click yes. The disk 1 format is MBR to change it to the GPT you should. Right click on disk 1 MBR and click convert MBR disk to GPT disk. Notice, to boot from the GPT disk, please enable UEFI boot mode from BIOS. After you apply the change, it mean after change disk 1 MBR to GPT, MBR legacy is no long boot to the BIOS mode. Click OK. Click apply to change safe. Click Yes. Click Restart now to complete Convert Disk 1 MBR to GPT on Windows 10. After completed convert disk you should change the BIOS mode. MBR legacy to UFI GPT mode close the virtual PC. Go to edit virtual machine settings. Go to options. Go to advanced. Change firmware type BIOS to UEFI mode. Then click OK to save and change. Start power virtual machine now Windows 10 EFI is set on UEFI mode boot successfully. To check UEFI mode boot you should extract programs mbr.efi. Go to file programs mbr.efi. Go to file easy UEFI x64. Run as administrator. Click Yes. Click OK. Go to Manager EFI Boot option. As you can see Windows Boot Manager is set on UFI mode. Partition number 4 disk format with source boot. File path slash EFI slash Microsoft slash boot slash bootenfew.fe fat32 GPT UEFI. After done convert the disk now let's install Grub2Win on Windows 10 EFI. Plus adding AIOBOT disk x.32.64.bit on Grub2Win list. And install manually on UFI memtis.x64. Extract Grub2Win install.zip. Go to File Grub2Win install. Go to File install. Right click and run as administrator. Click Yes. Click OK to continue with setup files. Select the target drive so you can install Grub2Win. As me I will choose E drive to install Grub2Win. Click setup for being install Grub2Win on E drive. Click return to the setup menu. Click close the setup programs. After done install Grub2Win on E-Drive it will be run automatic and show. 
to you the program. To complete it Grub2 Win set on Windows Manager Boot. You should to add List2 on Grub2 Win to set on Manager Boot menu. On the list Grub2 Win. Click Manager Boot menu. Add a new entry. Go to Type. Choose Chain Load a file. Select a new chain load file. Go to AIOBOT disk e source chain load file is FE slash boot slash grub 64.FE. Click open to select adding FE file. Rename title chain load to AIO underscore boot underscore wing 64 underscore CRT dot B.0.9.8.17.21. Click the icon and choose icon you like. Click apply to save change. Click OK. You can set up on second boot list. Let's add new reboot system so we can reboot the PC. Make sure the pause seconds no count number all of it so. You can boot direct without time. You can change pause seconds time and hotkey for short words. Click Apply to Save Change. To add or install manually memtis.x64 on UEFI. Extract memtis86.64 copy file to AIOBOTI disk e. Let's add memtis86.64 on Grub2 winlist. Click Manager Boot menu. Add a new entry. Go to Type. Choose Chain Load a File. Select a new Chain Load File. Go to AIOBOT Disk e Source Chain Load File is Memdist 86.64 slash but 64.fe. Click Open to select Adding FE File. Rename Title Chain Load to Memdist 86.64. Click the icon and choose icon you like. Click Apply to Save Change. Remove the pause seconds time number. Click OK. Click Apply to save change. To change background for Grub2 when you should go to preview of them basic 2. Customize. Click Add Background Images. Select Image then Open. The image was added to the source files Grub2 win. To change the background images you should click basic to show you images. Select the image you add. To change the grub timeout in colors list grub 2. Remove highlight selected item. Remove show boot mode. Remove show grub 2 1 version. Go to style change clock to progress bar. Change timeout to 15 second. Click title choose any color you like. Click OK to change. Click Selected Item Choose Any Color You Like. Click OK to Change. Then click OK to Save Change the Settings. Click Change and Save Grub2 Win to Completed Boot List. As you can see the Grub2 Win is completed after Change List Boot and Background. Image Now you need Reboot Your PC or Laptop to Windows Boot Manager EFI. Plus Grub2 Win List. As you can see the Windows Boot Manager FE is changed and already have Grub2 win. On the list at the first boot Grub2 FE list. Let's check boot up IOBoot Wing 64 CRT.V.0.9. It's already work on EFI mode. Let's reboot IOBoot. Let's check boot up Memtist 86.64. It's already work on EFI mode. To reboot Memtist 86.64, press X to exit and reboot the PC. Now let's go to boot up Windows 10 EFI. Hopefully you enjoy the video with the guide it's now Grub2 Win EFI list plus IOBoot and Memtist 86.64 already running on Windows 10 EFI. Don't forget like subscribe and share with yours friends. Thank you for watching.